$1,750. Just take the zero off. <laughs> Buying used computers has been around since the day after the very first person ever upgraded their PC. It's a chance to save some money compared to buying the whole system brand new, or you can effectively subsidize the cost of your new system by uh, selling the old one, all without creating any e-waste. But whatever your reason for buying or selling on the used market, and regardless of wherever you choose to browse, it's safe to bet that you are gonna come across some ridiculous ads. Crazy prices, <laughs> bad part combos, poorly written ads. Oh yeah. It's all fair game for us to roast. Oh yeah, let's go. But not before I make this awful segue for you guys to roast to our sponsor. Waveform, weak cell signal? Check out the Cellfi Go X signal booster, sold and supported by Waveform. The Go X is the only booster with 100 decibel gain, giving you more coverage and blazing fast data rates. Learn more at the link below. Okay, so this one's being sold for $3,000. Or best offer. Yeah, okay, that's important. Being sold on eBay too. RGB gaming PC custom build ultimate desktop bundle. I finished this build in February of 2022 and I'm very proud of it. Good for you, dude. This was my dream build where I spared no expense on parts. No expensive. Shipping is included in the price. Man, oh. I would not recommend buying things off Craigslist that end up having to be shipped. If you're interested in seeing the RGB functions, DM me for my TikTok link. <laughs> 3060 Ti, 400 bucks. So you got a $400 GPU, you got like 200 bucks in RAM. Oil. It only comes with a 250 gig SSD. Spared, no expensive. Your shit is not worth this much money. It's got more in RGB than it does graphics card. <laughs> Gaming and desktop PC computer, Intel i7, GT710, oh, one no. terabyte HHD with Dell monitor, 16 gigabytes of RAM. Oh, it's a four by three display. I love it. It's adorable. Mm, PS2. PS2. Well, you know what? PS2 is not bad. Okay, what's the spec? i7-3770. It's not bad. If you look at the location of the 12 volt connector for the CPU, this is definitely an OEM board. Yeah. So I mean, like look this at was it. an office PC that was thrown into a gaming PC chassis and called a gaming PC. Really, I think the best value proposition here is this monitor. Yeah. Um, really uh, kind of rounds it out. We're gonna move over to Kijiji. For you American folks, Kijiji is a Canadian equivalent sort of to Craigslist, just with like a little bit newer UI and just as crazy stupid on it. This is an Alienware X17 R1 with 165 watts. So this guy must go to LAN parties. Yeah, 11th Gen i9. So it's got a four terabyte SSD. So this brand new, newer version of, of this setup. It's got a 3080 Ti, a little bit better. It's got a newer CPU that's gonna have a bunch more cores. I think it's 14 versus eight. Everything else the same is substantially less money. I think this guy just missed the memo that used gaming laptops are worth practically f all. Well, this is what I paid for like two years ago. <laughs> Actually, it would have been one year ago. You should sell the case separately, dude. You'll get more money for it. Complete VR desktop for $450, excuse me. 450 Canadian, 350 US. Oh, it's an Optiplex. Is, is this actually a good deal? It's a 1050, eight gigs of RAM. I don't see a graphics card. <laughs> Monitor uh, has a large scratch on the screen. Uh, but it still works great. No, it doesn't have a graphics card. So Intel HD VR. <laughs> is this a joke? Uh, what VR headset is that? That's Samsung Odyssey VR. Wait, does it have the controllers? Okay, so this guy clearly just bought this to watch <laughs> Yeah, like, the, where are the controllers? I don't see controllers. Well, you don't need the controllers where we're going, honey. <laughs> Especially after you got that scratch in the screen, you know, that really... <laughs> Next. Oh man. Why are you giving me all these Alienwares? <laughs> what are we looking at here? So there's a there's a either a white with RGB. Here, or let me red. just let me just make this better. There we go. Now I oh. can see. Nice. Very. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Hang on. Oh yeah. Wow. You you're set up for it. <laughs> Too much of a computer for my needs. Well, why did you buy it then? Dual 2080 supers. MSI 34 inch curved gaming monitor. It's not attaching receipt so you can see the upgrades. <laughs> you bought every warranty. 
24-7 technical support for $300. <laughs> accidental damage service for three years for $130. What accidental damage are you going to do to your Alienware desktop, and dude? guess what? They're not even gonna come to your house like they told you. You paid as much in warranties as you did for your two terabyte SSD upgrade. At least it comes with a monitor. This is silly, dude. This no is issues, though. Going to sell and get myself something a little less intense. Potentially a laptop. With 128 gigs of RAM. <laughs> did your mom just give you her credit card and said, go ham, honey. Offer up. Now, I've never heard of offer up before. What am oh, I looking oh at? God. Okay, so this is just ball. Another out. 128 gigs of RAM. Why? Well, okay, hold on. This is a Threadripper system, actually. 2970WX. So which is like kind of now with the 3090s so that's very lopsided this is this is more of an art piece it's not yeah. even filled properly like look oh. at look at this huge air oh, bubble that's right painful. here put the flow meter in just to make sure you get really <laughs> crappy flow we got a corsair cpu block we got a fantex gpu block we got a bits power distribution plate we got a whatever radiator corsair fitting down there like this is just all over okay man 15 grand you sir are out to freaking lunch what is this photo? Yes, would Where you like to this? see the wall? What room is this? It's not very well painted. Linus would f himself. Finance available, yes, baby. <laughs> $37,750. You can make an offer. Maybe he Just meant take to the do zero that. Off. <laughs> Warranty included, so let's see what we got. 32 gigs of RAM, DDR5. Wait, DDR5 on 11th gen? What the f This has gotta be a price error. Brand Comes with a Red Dragon keyboard and mouse, yeah. I mean, Red Dragon's not bad, okay? It's not but 3080 it's... Ti tier. Yeah, no. <laughs> Ryzen 7, 32 gigs of RAM, one terabyte SSD. Okay, so what else? Oh, it's a GT1030. GT1030. Mm. All parts costed me $2,300. Can run light to mid games. It's got 5,800X. So here's what I think happened. This was a GPU shortage build. By the time GPUs came down in price, the guy was like, no, I want 12th gen. This liquid cooler cost more than this GPU. CPU definitely did. Maybe the RAM did too. So like $70, $80. That being said, it is relatively new parts. Yeah, man, but, but that's like, 1300 US dollars. Just People because are... you got f***ed in the GPU shortage doesn't mean that you need to pass that along to people outside of the GPU shortage now. <laughs> These photos, man, come on. Couldn't have turned the lights on? I guess maybe that would have drowned out the RGB. Facebook. Oh, good old Facebook. PC game ready for use. Specced on the picture. Everything I included. Uh, 9700F. That's it. That's all the information we get. That's, that's the specs? The spec'd. Windows 11 home. Wait, dev version. On the dev branch. <laughs> Dude, uh, you gotta at least tell us what GPU we're getting for 3,000 US dollars. He's got two mice too. Do we get everything in the photo? Oh, everything I included. Everything I included. Okay, so, so you get... also get the figurines. <laughs> yeah, do I get the figurines and the po- I want the drapes. I want the wall. Oh, from Saskatoon, baby. Ultimate gaming PC. Okay, this actually looks kind of cool. Yeah, actually, that's Gotta like custom the loop and everything. Multiple flow meters. Is that more than one? Is that a flow meter down there? A flow meter there? What's this thing? Is that another flow meter? I don't know. Did people not understand <laughs> that they like actually hurt the flow? Also, that bend. Check How about all that. of the bends? It's so wonky. It's got a Core i9, 9900K, oh oh a Radeon RX 5700 XT, and four, wait, 432 gig sticks of Trident Z Royal. We're again looking at 128 gig of RAM system. Why do people do this? You probably would have been better off paying somebody that knows how to water cool to build the loop for you. It would have looked better and just spent a little bit less on random bull Oh yeah, here's mid build. Each loop gets a flow meter. Yep. Yeah. And you get a flow meter. <laughs> and you get a flow meter. Oh my God, it's a mining oh, rig. Oh, a mining rig, of course. 26,000 Canadian, which is about 20,000 US dollars. Ah, uh, it's three months old. It's right at the beginning of the crash. Oh no. <laughs> he probably bought these for well above MSRP from like a mining rig company. Oh yeah, oh, I'm so happy. So many cards that could have gone to gamers went to this guy instead and then he got I like this side of Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> Full gaming setup, chair with LED lights. Oh Look at how many times he says RGB. It's like it's like when you go to CES, the amount of times you see disruptive. Nvidia, <laughs> 3060 Ti GPU worth two to three grand brand new. Was there ever a point that a 3060 Ti was two grand? This is Canadian, so even Canadian, I don't think oh it was worth God. two to three Everything grand. Everything was bought brand new, PC was custom built, paid around $10,000 for it. Oh, oh my God, he's asking seven grand I didn't even see. Oh my God. 
Bull and Or maybe not. Maybe the guy selling the $15,000 one sold it to him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, eBay, land of the good deals. Gaming PC, desktop, barely used. Monitors, mouse, and keyboard. So it's a 5900X and a 3080. Yeah, that's respectable. And oh, oh God. The glass that's got toe marks on it. Wait, you didn't even take this off? Connect all cables before turning on. Oh my God, it's a pre-built. There's no universe where this thing is worth $4,500. I mean, okay, if you were like a Twitch streamer and people wanted to buy your feet pics, they might also be down to buy your, <laughs> your feet schmear on the glass. So Jake, I had to ask you, how many of these people do you think are just hoping for a whale to come along and like just buy it for the astronomical <laughs> price? You mean like the whales from Whale Land? Whale Land? Yeah, Whale Land. We did a behind the scenes on Floatplane. You can see all the cool activities we did. You can see some sick PCs. You can even see me walking around. I think there's probably at least one clip of that. I always wanted to watch Jake walk around. Yeah. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> a thousand euros <sighs> for an i3. Goodbye. <laughs> Back to Craigslist gaming and editing ThinkPad. Yeah, it comes with a warranty. Workstation, it's got the nipple. It's got the nipple. Is that all you look for in a computer? Yes. Slightly used or lightly used. Ultra high spec. Gaming laptops, editing laptops, any used laptop depreciates way harder than a desktop. There's so many other variables. There's oh, yeah, the battery's gonna fail. The battery, yeah. There, it's way harder to clean. It's way harder to service. So many things make it way less of a value. Okay. So many Cheetos fall in between the cracks. Let's see this. So he bought a 48 month. Start December 2020. But it's only got a 10750H. And a 20, 2080 Super. 30 series was out then though. So he just got kind of screwed. I would not pay $3,500 for this. I mean, you'd be better off buying a cheaper laptop and an LTT store backpack. And then you can put the laptop in the backpack. Then you don't need the warranty. The backpack's gonna gonna keep it protected, you know? Prices firm, due to the high value of the item, we can high need value. a police station lobby. A, a laptop is, I guess, some one of those things that somebody would be like, lol, sucker, and like snatch and, just and grab. Yank it. Saying, due to the high value of this item, that just sounds like you're blowing smoke up somebody's ass. <laughs> God, that's a lot. Of, this is the Lee and Lee fans, right? Three packs, hundred bucks. Okay, so we have three hundred and thirty dollars in fans. At least it was easy to cable manage, though. Yeah, and it's got a fifty-nine fifty X in it too, which is not, not thirty ninety. Wait, what is what is that? It's wow. actual, literal rainbow yeah, bar. Rainbow bar. <laughs> Why do people buy Trident Z Royal? I don't know. Has, has anyone looked at that and been like, that looks nice? CPU never goes above 45 degrees max load. Oh yeah. Bullshit. That bullshit. It's a 5950X. It probably never goes below 45 degrees. Yeah, it would idle at that. Make an offer. If it's less than 6,000, I won't respond. Your ask is 6,000. What? We'll trade for cameras as I'm a photographer. Yeah, it really looks like it, buddy. <laughs> Okay, so stock cooler. In the garage. Covered in dust. With an AOC monitor that looks like it's been through a war. Looks like it's got some scratches. It's got the sneeze goop on there. Oh, the mm -hmm. back of the computer's got some sneeze goop on there Ooh. too. Oh God. The oh, keyboard. Clean the keyboard, man. And the way he's holding those headphones he's looks like he's... he's... I don't even want to touch them. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, Bluetooth. A... Razor, oh, of course he doesn't want to touch them. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the thing with this one. You didn't put any specs. Wow. Given that it's a single power plug, I'm gonna go with this is not a great GPU. Yeah, probably like a 60 and series. it's a smaller AMD cooler, I think. So probably like a Ryzen 5. 3600 or something yeah. like that, which is not a bad CPU, but for $1,500. Yeah, but then again, you're getting those bonuses. You get the AOC monitor that's the, the been no name. You we get, get the, the the finger goop. The finger goop. What is that? A poop stain right there? Oh yeah, that's brown. Yeah, this has been in that garage for too long, dude. <laughs> yeah. Twelve nine hundred K RTX thirty ninety build. Is this okay. not actually that bad of a price? So it's brand new. It looks pretty new. It's clean. clean. It would have to be. No like, toe fudge. And the uh, cable management looks pretty good. Oh, is that his personal info Dude, right he there? just put his whole address here. He doxed himself and right there. And the last four of his credit card number. Oh. God damn, dude. So he paid five grand for all this. Five I grand? I mean, 2800 $2, doesn't That's... actually seem that bad. Honestly, yeah. I, I don't think there's anything wrong with the actual listing other than the fact that he like straight up put his home address and the last four of his credit card. Okay, so we got nice. dual Nice, this channel. guy's got this too. Whoa! Oh, oh, the other way. <laughs> oh, I can't go the other way. <laughs> ah! We've got another instance of runs any game on 240 hertz. 
Is a 990 a thing? No. No, it's an i990. 32 gigabytes of RAM, eight fans. Ooh, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my God, he's counting the GPU fans. You're not wrong, it's just, ugh. 12900K, 500 bucks, 2080 Ti. We probably already looked this up already, I just don't remember. Uh, looks like also about 500 bucks. So you're talking $1,000 and he wants 2,500. But it's got eight fans, Jake. And it, <laughs> it comes with two monitors, maybe the desk, blue mic stand, a keyboard and three mice, three mouses. Three mouses. I, I, I know that I use three mouses all the time for my third hand. Wait, dude, okay, if you're gonna clean, like you clearly, <laughs> You used this canned air to clean the PC. Like we get that. What were you using clean shower for? <laughs> daily no, shower cleaner. Daily shower cleaner. Clean That's what it soap says. and mildew. Please, people, don't use this on your PC. Okay, you just put no effort into this at all. So we can see all of Come his drives. Come on! You didn't even. Holy crap! Don't, yo, the cable management is bad. Oh, that, that's an understatement. Oh. Look at this. He got like a Molex to SATA adapter in the and front. It's like here. it's like the, the cables are all dragging on each other too. People put no effort in at all. Like if that's the one thing I've seen. Oh man, the 5820K. That's like the the oh. absolute cheapest X99 CPU you could have bought. Yep. GTX 1080 Hybrid, Corsair Vengeance, yeah, 32 gigs, Asrock X99 Extreme 4. It comes with all this other stuff, It maybe it's not that bad. I'm just, I, I don't know. With all connectors to start gaming immediately. Goodbye. Gaming computer with two Acer curved monitors and they work, just I do not know how or why they won't connect properly. That sounds like they don't work. Or the computer's broken. What the hell? Did he just steal this? Bunch of extra stuff and a Google Pixel 3a. It is factory Wait, it comes reset. With a phone? This this must be like a storage stolen locker goods. maybe or stolen goods. Yeah. Don't ask me a bunch of questions. I don't know a lot about computers. So how do you know that it's two thousand dollars? This is sketchy, dude. You see this? Yeah. So that's like one of those one fan. No, there's there's more fans below no, it. No, but one RGB. The rest are just normal. I think that's just G. <laughs> Four hundred bucks for a twenty sixty super. Yeesh. It's an i5. That's all you get. It's just the first two letters. It's an i5. So okay, or what the first two characters? What's that motherboard? I can. I. There's no way we're reading that, dude. This thing is a turd. Sixty bucks for this desk. Oh, look at that sick monitor stand. Wait, Big, are those the Razer speakers? That was the game. <laughs> look, Razer speaker. He only has one side. Only one side. How what? do you lose one side of your Razer speakers? What? Maybe what happened was he got so fed up with Razer and a fit of rage in this realization that he destroyed the other speaker. I like how he's asking $150 for the Steam controller. Yeah, that's like the most expensive thing there, save for the computer itself. It's almost as expensive as this segue to our sponsor. Pulseway, do you ever find yourself needing to remotely manage your network devices from less than convenient locations, like dropping your kids off at school or when you're in line for lunch? Well, Pulseway can help. With Pulseway's all-in-one platform, you can centrally manage all your desktops, servers, and network devices, making IT management easy. They have desktop and mobile apps, so you'll be the first to know when things go wrong wherever you might be, and you can run scripts, build automation workflows, remote control any system, reset user passwords, or even set up custom notifications for Windows, Mac OS, or Linux. Plus, thanks to their auto remediation technology and fully customizable end user portal, you'll have more time for the things that you love while Pulseway takes care of the rest. And the best part? You can do all of it on the go wherever you are. Super cool, right? So what are you waiting for? Try it for free today and save up to 40% with the special offer for our followers at the link down below. So thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, maybe check out the video where we roasted a bunch of setups. Yeah. Like, or the second time we did it. Or the third time we do it. We're just kidding. Well, I mean, this it. was basic. Like we, we roasted a bunch of setups here too. Yeah, we roasted like, the setups. We roasted the toe smudge, but we also roasted your selling capabilities. Yeah, and a lot of them are not very good. No. Oh.